Hey fellow DJs, my name is DJ Benny James from London, England, but now I live in the USA and I just wanted to make a short video to help some of you that are using a new MacBook, uh, maybe new MacBook, MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, something like that. If you're using Catalina um, and you're having issues um, with your with your Serato recognizing your old iTunes, um, this video may help. I've been looking online and I didn't really see anything that would really help me. So hopefully this helps you, okay? So if you are not running Catalina, okay, and you don't use Serato, then this is a waste of your time. You can just close out of this video, okay? Uh, but if you, if you are using those and you are having issues, hopefully this will help you, okay? So basically, here's some basic things that you need to know. I, I don't know how to share the screen with you and show you different things. I'm just going to talk about it and hopefully that's enough for you. Okay, so the first, first thing you need to do is make sure your drivers and everything is up to date on your software. Okay, I have a Pioneer SZ board, which is a big uh, flagship model that first came out with Pioneer. And I had to go into Pioneer's archive driver uh, page to download the drivers because when I transferred all my information from my old computer to my new computer, I guess the drivers didn't work or they disappeared or whatever. So I actually had to go there, uninstall the drivers and then reinstall the drivers for the SZ. So basically, as long as, I don't know what system you have, but it, in your, if you have a controller, make sure that all the drivers are up to date, all the software is up to date and also on your Serato, make sure your Serato has the newest version of, of Serato, okay? Catalina will not recognize old uh, versions, okay? So make sure that everything is up to date, the newest versions, and you've got all your drivers for your hardware. You got that? Okay. Uh, next thing is sometimes you will come up with, as you're installing or you're starting up your new computer, you might get this box that comes up that says um, system extension block, okay? And basically what that's saying is, uh, do you want us to accept or can we use um, extension, like other devices, basically, can they, can they use your computer? Now, you'll see other videos on YouTube about this and there's some really helpful ones out there, okay? But basically you don't want to put, you don't want to say okay. What you want to do is go into system preferences and then from there you'll see things like a, a box that pops up saying Pioneer wants to use your computer, Serato wants to use your computer and from there you allow it. Don't say okay on that first box that comes up otherwise you're going to be screwed for quite some time like I was, okay? Anyway, the most important thing, this is what I found out today from Pioneer. Okay, this is what I found out, which I didn't know. As you, as you may know by now, iTunes is pretty much gone, okay? If you have a new computer, then iTunes has been replaced with Apple Music. Now, basically, Serato does not recognize iTunes, um, doesn't you recognize Apple Music the same way it did Apple Music, okay? So there's a simple fix to this. And when I did this today, I couldn't believe how easy it was, okay? So I'm gonna do it on my computer and talk through it with you. You won't see what I'm doing though. So open you open up um, Apple Music and then you go, uh, you hover over at the top where it says file and everything, right? It says file, edit, song, everything else. You hover over the music and then you go down to preferences, okay? I'm clicking on preferences. And then you have general, playback, files, restrictions, and advanced. Go on to files, all right? And where it says keep mu music media folder organized, and it also says on the next one down, copy files to music media folder when adding music, okay? You need to uncheck those boxes. Both of them are going to be checked when you open it. You need to uncheck them. And when you uncheck them, basically, um, Serato can then read your iTunes, okay? Read your Apple Music, whatever you want to call it. Because the problem I was having is that on Serato, I could see my music, 
but I couldn't see my playlists, all right? So any playlists that I made in iTunes or Apple Music, it's now called, any playlists that I made for weddings or parties or whatever, and I named them and I had all those playlists, whenever I plugged in Serato, it would not bring up those playlists. It would only bring up crates that were made in Serato, okay? So for me, that was really frustrating because for me, for 20 years or whatever, how long I've been doing this, I've been making my playlist on iTunes and then I go into Serato and I tell Serato to read my iTunes. And it was reading my iTunes, but it wasn't showing the playlist, okay? It was also creating tons of doubles of music as well. So just doing that simple thing on Apple Music, go into Preferences, you'll see files click on files and then uncheck uncheck those two boxes and you'll be fine if you're not fine i recommend closing down your restarting your computer and then hopefully that will work if not then you're going to need to contact serato okay but um i really hope this helps because i tell you what i've been going around in circles for like three weeks trying to figure this out and uh, finally, I got somebody at Pioneer today that was helpful. This guy called Bruce. Thank you, Bruce. And he sent me the link um, to what to do if you have Catalina and what to do to iTunes, to um, Apple Music to make things work. Okay. So anyway, sorry, I couldn't show you. I don't know how to do all that. I'm not a technical geek, so I didn't know what I had to show you. But hopefully me just talking about it will really help you. Okay. Um, good luck. Hopefully you don't have as much uh, challenges as I did, okay? Other than that, if you like good soul music, uh, I'm a soul, funk, R&B, hip-hop DJ, and I started a podcast. Uh, the podcast is DJ Benny James Podcast. Pretty simple. You can Alexa it. I'm on iTunes. I'm on iHeartRadio, Spotify, everything else. Be uh, DJ Benny, B-E-N-N-I-E, -E, James Um I said DJ Benny James, or you can go to my website, djbennyjames.com for more information. All right. But if you like soul, funk, R&B, uh, check out, see what you like. All right. Peace out. Thanks very much, guys. Hope this helped.